Hello, this is a continuation, part six of chapter five of The Shepherd, the Flock of God, Elder's Handbook. We're going to now read paragraph 58, which is on page uh, 78. If the elders see that such a person is a threat to the flock, they can privately warn those in danger. For example, despite the announcement, the wrongdoer might attempt to socialize with youths in the congregation. In that situation, the elders would speak privately to the parents of the endangered ones and maybe to those youths also. Paragraph 59. There is no specific arrangement for an appeal or a seven-day waiting period before announcing the decision that one is no longer recognized as an unbaptized publisher. If he expresses dissatisfaction with the conclusion, the body of elders should choose two different elders to review the case. Paragraph 60. If someone who was previously removed as an unbaptized publisher begins to make progress and wishes once again to share in the ministry, two elders, perhaps those who met with him earlier, should meet with him to determine his qualifications. If he qualifies, an announcement should be made that he is an unbaptized publisher. There is no need to wait until he reports field service again to make the announcement. Paragraph 61. If the unbaptized publisher is a minor by law, the two elders should first speak with the Christian parents to discern what occurred the child's attitude and the corrective steps that the parents are taking. If the parents have the situation in hand, the two elders may choose not to meet with the minor, but will check with the parents from time to time to offer helpful counsel specific suggestions and loving encouragement. Paragraph 62. When an unbaptized publisher is involved in wrongdoing, the two elders assigned to meet with him should prepare a written record of the case. The secretary files this record in the same manner as the files judicial cases. Well, I hope you enjoyed this uh, series of chapter five of the Shepherd of Flock of God uh, handbook. Um, I hope you learned something from it, as I certainly did learn a lot while I was reading it, because this is my first time actually reading the entire chapter. Um, I also want to go over chapters 6 and 7 as well. Um, so stay tuned for those chapters in the near future, and um, everyone have a good day.